Okay, those are the two new ones. The one on the left is Roxy. The one on the right, this white one, is Sylvia. So we've got Roxy, Sylvia, Esma. Esma is the boss. And Sylvia is the lowest at the moment because Sylvia and Roxy are new and they get bullied by even the little Cindy that's already in there. So now we can see how Esma follows Cindy's lead because Cindy is a little bit more clever than Esma. But Esma is actually much tamer. And because she's a boss, I think she's got the direct you know connection to her keepers, I guess. So she's much bolder. But she's gone to bed now as well. Hopefully. No. Before we had chicken, I would not have believed how structured they are and what strict hierarchies they have. Chicken has its place, and I'm not joking. Or not a place. I've heard of um, when we got them, two of the little chicken were actually bullied by all the others. I can you imagine, like several hundred chicken on a farm and they, are, they pick on two chicken. And it's really mean. First we thought it was just Esma, but no, they're all like that. Oh, there she goes. Very nice. I suppose those two, if they had enough water and food today, they go to bed now as well. They're already preening, so that's a good sign. Of course, the lowest one is still trying to get some food in, because she was hiding most of the day. That's Sylvia on the right. I'm sure they're going to go to bed soon. relative. They've been here now, let me think, Wednesday, um, it's Wednesday today, they've been here since Saturday evening, so they're still trying to get settled. But they're doing all right. Yeah, I think Roxy is going for bed. Waited long enough, now it's all okay. Hopefully she won't get packed too much getting in there now. Just taking aim. I'm sure a fox can't get up there, totally. Yeah, go for it, babe. There, got packed. It's actually interesting that Sylvia is bigger than all the other chicken, but she's the youngest at the moment. I think her face is still very pale, so apparently it goes red when they get older and laying eggs, so and that's why she's so unsure of herself. I'm sure as time goes by, she's going to be, you know, if she gets enough to eat <laughs> and to drink, she's not going to be so tame anymore. She knows she gets up there, she's gonna get picked upon. But she go. It's a very pretty bird then. Shame she's so shy at the moment. Yeah. She tries to get in there from another way, but <laughs> from another end. 
not gonna work, darling. Come on. There's the hole that the carpenter left. Which was me in this case. There you go, no Yes, darling. Go in there. Come on. You could at it. Come on. Very nice. Oh, look at that. Peck, peck, peck. Oh no. She knows the place. Well done. Cool. So, now comes the daily task that I've got to do. So I'm just going to have a quick look before they are in there. There's Cindy on the shelf there. They don't have to sit on the shelf. There's actually lots of shelves right in there. And, you know, Esme and the girls are just hiding on there. Yeah. Oh, someone's back on. Oh no. Hand fired. Well, we better leave them to it. Good night.